This story will cover from then to now and next, all about change, how to turn losers into winners. We're in Somerset, in the west of England, not far from the large city of Bristol. Just down the road from here is a typical Somerset village called Chew Magna. Down amongst the trees, by a stream, is a kind of wilderness with a rather unusual community coexisting there. Some viewers may remember an American TV series called Meet the Fockers, featuring some amusing characters in various amusing family situations. It's now time to meet the Nutters. Whereas the original Meet the Fockers cast became known and enjoyed all over the world on television, the non-human cast of The Nutters is probably as intriguing and as entertaining here in their own ways. And there are quite a few brought together around the offer of peanuts by the stream. The wildlife characters include Woody Woodpecker, Robin, without Batman, Dunno, the Dunnock, Ron, the Heron, and various tits. It's a bit silly, really. Now, here's an animal both liked and disliked. Grey squirrels were originally introduced from North America in 1876 and have subsequently spread disease to our popular cute red squirrel, though they, the greys, are not affected. They are very versatile and quite bold and favour cherries, for example. This tree, cherry, was never allowed to produce a ripe red cherry. The greys have outcompeted the reds in much of Britain perhaps the role of the villain in our story. And of course nuts are a great attraction, if you can get at them. This kind of feeder is supposed to be squirrel proof, but is it? Well, we'll see. Now look out for falling bits of peanut. He's looking for a weakness in the design and strength of materials. Feeder makers, please note the roof bags. This will be an ongoing challenge. And they need a bigger feeder with claws, not jaws. Yeah. 